Hey guys, Peter from 630 here. Easy one today, how to tighten your chain on a single speed. Hey there, you only need three tools, um, maybe two really. You need a Phillips, most likely, a 10 millimeter and a 15 millimeter, or just a, a crescent wrench, all right? Um, Maybe Nate, you can come in and get some details. This is a 630 from a long time ago that I custom painted actually. Um, it's in my garage. Paint a picture of my wife and my son there on it. But anyway, the first thing you gotta do, there's gonna be a coaster break. And so you just wanna loosen that. So we'll stick the Phillips in there and the 10 millimeter here. We just loosen it. You don't wanna take it all, off all the way. Just, just loosen so that this part can slide back and forth in this slot here. And then Go right over here. And then all we do is just go ahead and loosen the two axle nuts. These are 15 millimeters. Once they're a little bit loose, there we go, about finger finger loose there where you can move it with your finger. The, uh, the wheel will slide in and out of these slots. They're made like that so that the chain can be adjusted. What I like to do is you can pull it back like this. Um, but I like to use uh, my hand in the front to kind of make sure that I have it centered because the, the, the wheel can tilt to the right or the left. So you need to do what's called floating it, just make sure that it's centered. It's really easy to do. Um, but yeah, just to tighten it, all you need to do is just move the wheel back some more. So I'm just gonna pull it back, put some tension on it here with my right hand, feel the tension. The chain should deflect about maybe half an inch up and a half an inch down. Um, so about an inch total, more or less is a pretty good thumb rule. So then what we'll do is once we've got it tightened and I'm holding it there with my right hand and I'm tightening with my left hand. <clears throat> There's some other tricks too if you wanna get it extra tight. You can tighten one axle nut and then just kind of like walk the wheel back and forth, um, alternating the, the axle nuts. But that's a little more of a, a little more of a complicated operation. But if you're having a hard time tightening it, that can be done too. I'm not gonna show that in this video though. But basically what you do is just, you'll tighten one move the wheel back, then tighten that one to hold it in position, then loosen the other one, then, and then force the wheel back, and just keep walking it back until you get the uh, tension that you like. So here we are, finishing up tightening the axle nuts. Make sure they're nice and tight. You don't want those loose at all. And then finally, we'll go back to secure the coaster brake arm over here in its little slot. Just use the um, Phillips, and then you can also use the wrench to tighten it down there you go that's really all there is to it that's nice and tight all right thanks for watching i really hope that was helpful if you uh, need any more help please don't hesitate to contact us at 310-982-2877 or the team at 630.com 630 is spelled out s-i-x-t-h-r-e-e-z-e-r-o also subscri subscribe to our channel and remember it's your journey your experience enjoy the ride